Hi, I'm Pastor Steve, and this is the Poke in the Eye devotional for January 6th, 2024. It's Epiphany. Today's verse from the One Year Bible is Proverbs 1, 32 to 33. For the waywardness of the simple will kill them, and the complacency of fools will destroy them. But whoever listens to me will live in safety and be at ease without fear of harm. You know what? There are too many simple Christians. They live complacently as fools, ignoring God's word, trusting in voices and visions instead of going directly to the source, the Bible. Listen, if you had a treasure map that directed you to millions in gold, would you trust the advice of other miners or wander aimlessly in the hills with a metal detector? No, but that's what most believers do, ignoring the written words of life at their fingertips, replacing his recorded wisdom for praise, prayer, and problematic perceptions. I know, I know, you're just not a morning person. Not many are, including me. Charles Spurgeon wrote this, though. In the morning is the fittest time with God. An hour in the morning is worth two in the evening. If you have a problem getting up in the morning, you can always do what the Cambridge Seven did to make sure (laughs) he didn't miss the morning watch. Now, the Cambridge Seven were a group of wealthy, educated, and prominent athletes who gave up everything to be missionaries to China. They committed to spending the first part of a new day alone with God, praying and reading the Bible. One man had trouble getting up in the morning, so he invented an automatic, foolproof cure for laziness, a contraption set up by his bed. This is what it did. The vibration of an alarm clock set fishing tackle in motion and the bed sheets clipped to the line, move swiftly into the air off the sleeper's body. (laughs) You, you may just have to ignore the snooze option on your iPhone and simply make a commitment to not be a weak and lazy Christian. This was your Poke in the Eye devotional. You can read them at stonethepreacher.com. I'm Pastor Steve. I hope you see a little more clearly today.